Doing facial animation is very difficult. It's something that's really time consuming. It's hard to get uh, the lip sync right. We have, as 3D artists, uh, struggled with this for a really long time. And I'm super excited to share with you today how we are approaching the same problem with Love is a Championship. Oh, Whitney, I'm so excited about this year's Super Bowls. Hey, Pumpkin, give me a hug. Oh, um, no. <laughs> People always think I'm Charlie, but I'm not. So using Reillusion's iClone, they have a new feature called AccuFace. And AccuFace is a, a, an up-leveled version of the previous uh, LiveFace. So LiveFace before used this type of um, attachment where you had like your iPhone, et cetera. It would measure um, your expression live from your face and then it would translate it to the, the 3D character. But now what we have is we have the ability to uh, pre-record video uh, using a calibration of that person's face and to translate it onto their digital avatar. It does a, a really good job to be able to get you to a spot very, very quickly with uh, AccuFace. Lucy, Lucy, wait. No, no, no! Penalty? Too many men on the ice. <sighs> yes! Woo! Oh, shh, shh. So if you can see, you can see the comparison from the, uh, the actor to their digital avatar. There are um, the different uh, points of influence. Exactly. And it's not going well. I am 0 for 7. So this data is actually transferable through uh, to Maxon, to Maya, to Blender, Houdini, Unreal Engine, uh, NVIDIA Omniverse. And that's why I'm super excited about that, to really be able to leverage the different talents of our team, et cetera. So if you're interested in learning more, uh, stay tuned for my next video. I'll do more of an in-depth tutorial, and I'll kind of show you how to do that in detail so that you can maybe use that on your projects. Let's go this way, I can see the lights. Hey, Luce, look over here. Oh yeah, somebody told me it was a ring bear. Uh, and I was like, God, that's gonna be hot. You know, we're in the fur. I'm going nah, to people and everything like that. We've seen this before, and all it takes is one big win to turn things around. I'm a big fan of uh, Real Illusion. I'm a big fan of these tools. I really think that it's um, uh, not only democratizing animation, but it's also just helping us elevate the quality of our animations in general. I don't think that things necessarily need to be done faster to be cheaper. I think that we can use that speed as well to make the end product better. Thanks so much for the time. Uh, thank you for your support of this project. Love is a championship and I'll see you soon. Bye.